we're gonna do Dr. Toy part one. Honestly, this is completely out of left field. I didn't think they were going to add Dr. Mario, so it's a nice surprise. Because usually they, like, keep most of the spin-offs separate from each other. I wonder if this was supposed to be for Dr. Mario World, but then... Like, COVID happened, and then it just never came to be, but... Bruh, that's just a freaking uh, miracle cure, Dr. Mario Render. Um, okay, you get that one by default. Yo. Please be second place. Nice. Woo. Did good on that one. Bro, they got warrior now. I don't know if I'll go for Dr. Luigi, because he doesn't have any signature hat, but I do want to get Dr. Mario. Like, come on, how can you have Dr. Luigi without the hat? Oh, whoa, they actually put in the bad wagon. It's pretty cool, man. I'm going to get all of these. How often is the Steel Diver used? Because I don't really feel like I see it much, but I mean, I could level that up. Maybe. Koopa Cloud, level 4. There's no sense in waiting to pull for Dr. Mario, right? I mean, I could just do that now. If I wanted to anyway. But, to be fair, I should also probably do the free pipes first. I definitely want to, I mean, I feel like I want to try to get Dr. Peach and Dr. Bowser, but, like, maybe another time. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, wait, you mean the pipes, yeah. By your Rosalina. You know, I should just make a notepad of all the characters I use so I can put them in as tags on the YouTube videos easily. Because you usually have to go back into the video footage and then see all the characters. Because I just freaking type in all the characters I use and then put them in the tags. So as to make some visibility for the video on YouTube. I also type in all the tra- oh my god. Wait, is this 200 CC? I don't think I did this right, damn it. Weird. Didn't feel like 200 CC. Oh, no, that was. Okay. Maybe I'm already used to the speed. 
Um, hopefully I get another frenzy. Bro, that was a way too trophy. Also, may the force be with you, Kappa. Door stream incoming. Oh, crap. Uh... I feel like the obvious thing to do would be to stream Star Wars, but I'm not really invested into any Star Wars games right now. I hear the freaking uh, Fallen Order game's pretty good, but... Eh, I don't feel like it right now. Oh my god, I hate this. Just, just quit everything. Okay. Also, I j Honestly, I hope they release some more than the four Doctor characters I already have planned. Cause like... It'd be hilarious if there was like freaking Doctor Goomba Tower and Doctor Dawson. And like, Doctor Wario or something as characters. In this game. Imagine if they just put in every doctor from world as leftovers. The hilarity. We would just have like 20 doctor characters. Damn it! Okay. Uh, maybe I'm not good with the 200 CC. I'm just trying to freaking combo everything. I'm not used to drifting this fast. Oh, okay, well, it's giving me mushrooms. Aw, oh, crap. You know what? Screw everything. I don't mind 200cc if it's not interfering with how I multi-combo, but if I can't do that, then I don't know. Maybe I'll come back to this later. Because I usually am able to do a full chain on this stage. And that isn't happening right now. Mostly just because I suck at drifting, but like, I don't have time to drive back somewhere and like, do stuff. I don't know, usually I feel like it helps my combos flow easier. Because, like, I'm able to just, you know, not worry about how, how much, like, time in between combos I do. It's like, usually there's, like, a, like, a period of time you have to, like, continue the combo, and, like, 200cc is like, okay, I'm gonna just continue it instantly, because... You're just going really fast, so you're just gonna make it to the next ramp or coin or whatever you need to do. Soon enough. It's just drifting is a little bit hard. Gotta get my notepad open. Mm -hmm. I 
also don't like what they did with the escalators. I know that was also in Mario Kart 7, but like, no. Don't care. I don't know if I should take the bottom route or the top route. One track. The cars actually move in this version. <laughs> Hopefully they put that in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, maybe. Yeah, usually I miss, like, a couple rims, but I also, like, usually it's, like, in a chain of rims, so I don't know. I'll use this one. I don't know, 200 cc is a little crazy for me right now, but... I guess another downside to the freaking uh, gold pass is that it means less streams, which might not be as good for my view counts or something. Because, like, I don't know. I feel like maybe having three to four parts would, like, help engagement. It's, like, more spread out throughout, like, the week. But, like... With a gold pass, it probably have I probably only have like two parts, and then it's done because of how the coins work. At least I'm speculating. It probably cut off at least one or two parts.
mean, I suck at this. Crap, I still have to keep typing all these character names, I forgot. Just type in this out. Hold up. Okay, you know what? Screw gold pass. Double screw gold pass. Bruh, I hate when that happens. I hit restart and I hear the fucking items go off and then I hear a frenzy and I'm like, oh, okay. Justice for Dr. Luigi's hat. He needs to keep it. Oh, you little... Holy crap, this is like way fast. I can't freaking focus on what I have to do. Oh, that's my next move. With 200 CC, I have to freaking act fast. I can't. I don't have time to plan what item I'm going to use next or whatever I do. I have always have a, like a methodical plan to how I play this game. It messes with my way of thinking. Man, fast.
while since I've seen this as a regular racetrack. Ironically, I used to like playing Gold Pass more than I did the regular game. Because I felt like it was too slow. But like, now that I'm used to the regular one more, I feel like that one is too fast. Idea. Get any of the line out. Play Dr. Mario Profit. Oh, my switch is not on for some reason. Hold up. I had a uh, many us online. Freaking Dr. Mario. I don't know. I like to do that. Hello. Been a while since we've seen GBA Bowser's Castle. So it was just typing out more YouTube tags. Bombs? I always like giving points to the first thing I see. Okay, let's go, Bowser's Castle. It is a little fast for me to process. It is somewhat exhilarating as well. So, like, it has its benefits and downsides. Double-edged sword, if you will. 
Bro, I'm just like freaking 150 cc speed at this tiny form. It's good to be on top of the YouTube tags because it makes it less annoying to type out later. Because I always have to freaking look at my Oh, Rock. Bruh. Someone's name for Roxas. We got another King of Baba moment. Still not used to calling him that instead of Big Baba, but it's a thing. That's his name now. Hey, oh, there. We're in 200 CC now, so things are a little bit different. Well, 2 CC should at least help on this track, because I'm not good at comboing. I think this will make it easier, but I don't actually know. Okay, well, I just missed all those coins, so maybe not. Okay, screw you and your bananas. Bombs? Big Babon about to be sued for acts of terrorism. I feel like I always leave the Babon behind me and never throw it in front of me because like, I can't ever hit anything if it's in front of me. Just doesn't make sense. Time trial. I don't really know where to use the mushroom here. I guess preferably an area where I can't really drift. Doesn't really exist on this track, I think. I guess other than the end. Honestly, it doesn't really matter. Because usually these are easy. Bro, that cheap cheap just pushed me.
Why, yo? Yeah, using it at the end stretch is pretty helpful because, like, there's not really much of a way, no way to, anywhere to drift. Sure, why not? Oh, yeah. True, as well. Coconut mold, let's go. Oh, yeah, um, this one is Daisy Fairy, I think. Yeah. Just typing that in for reference. On my notepad. The handy nandy notepad. Oh man, you suck. Ow. The cars don't move in this version. By the way, CF, uh, you didn't see the first time I did Coconut Mall, but they, the cars actually move in the regular version in this game, but they don't in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, which is pretty funny. MKT fans, stay winning, Kappa. Let's go. Wow, 30 Herbies, that's quite a bit. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, did y'all see the Spongebob movie Rehydrate it? I thought it was pretty good. The voice acting was pretty good and the animations were pretty funny. Wait, what's a huge fan? I forget what I was talking about. Oh, bruh. Well, um... Oh, no. Wait, both Mario and Luigi? Oh, no. Wait, 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 wait. Can it be any Mario and Luigi? Maybe I'll just purposely play as Mario and Luigi on any track where there is a Mario and Luigi. I mean, it's worth it for 30 of them, right? Bruh. 
bruh. If it was any version of Mario and Luigi, I would be like, okay, I mean, there's plenty of Mario's in the game, I can do that. But no, now I'm like, oh no. Bruh, who thought this was a good idea? Base Mario and Luigi. Bruh, Cubivore, the GameCube game. I don't know if y'all heard of that, but I would never have from Melee. It's a trophy. Oh yeah, Spongebob Rehard Cherry Day was pretty good. Oh no, the GameCube game is trying to beat me. Wow. It's really fast, but it's also somewhat exhilarating. Yeah, me too. Finally, a full combo. I feel like they should have at least put descriptions on the spirits and like had a collage mode like there was for stickers and brawl and trophies and both of those games. Like a collage mode would have been really funny. Like I like arranging all the random characters in pictures next to each other. Come on, man. Okay, coconut ML tea. We got here. Oh, 